Well, for many years we have been analyzing large amounts of data, but it often takes many hours to, to perform some of the computations that we do. So uh, by using uh, more than one processor, uh, we were able to harness the power of hundreds or, or even thousands of processors in parallel and are able to do the computations much, much faster. Companies have adjusted over time to the fact that some of these computations take a long time. And now they have a chance to say what happens, what could happen if I could get my results almost instantaneously. Uh, you know, in a banking uh, environment where banks have to compute hundreds and hundreds of models every year, and, they, and they're changing almost every month or every week to be able to do better prediction and better forecasting. If these things can be done a hundred times faster, then they're going to be able to do, you know, uh, probably 10 or 20 times more models in the same amount of time than that they would have before. And that speed, the, the importance of changing models rapidly is incredibly important in, in the banking industry. Well, we're seeing a lot, of, uh, a lot of other vendors talking about high performance, but what they're talking about is simply moving an SQL database into memory along with the data. Uh, that does serve up data a lot faster. But when it comes to things like uh, computing regressions and uh, uh, logistic uh, models, uh, they can't do it because that, that type of computational ability is not built into, the, into databases and probably never will be. So uh, if you really want high-performance analytics versus just simple BI, which, are, which is what other vendors call analytics, then SAS is definitely the, the place you want to go.